Okay, so you can use this spray in between washes. It is very easier to use a spray mist, you know, to moisturize your hair. You don't need to uh, manipulate it here. So I've had these braids for almost two weeks. Yeah, so I do low manipulation hairstyles. I'm trying to grow out my edges. Yeah, so weekend is our wash day. So this will help actually to lessen breakage when you undo your braids. You know, moisturized hair is prone, is is not prone to breakage. Yeah. Hello dear friends, welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how I make a moisturizing hair mist, which you can use to moisturize your hair. And if, especially if you have braids or maybe um, any braids, it's very easy to use a mist to moisturize your hair. So it helps to lock in the moisture and it will also make your hair soft so that as you undo the braids, you won't experience much breakage. Our hibiscus herbs. And we call it in our jar. And then we will get our glycerin. We'll pour it over the herbs. So you have to make sure that your glycerin covers your herbs. So glycerin has the moisturizing effects. It seals the moisture. It traps in the moisture in your hair. And hibiscus rejuvenates the scalp and it grows your hair. So I will leave my um, uh, glycerate for three days so that it can infuse. So beautiful pinkish color. I glycerate hibiscus. Wow, I love it. These are the products that I'm going to use. So we'll get our water. I'm using deodorized water. I don't use tap water. But if you are doing products for yourself, not for sale, probably you can get away with um, tap water. So 50% of water. Then we'll get our spray bottle and the funnel and pour our water into the spray bottle. Okay, then we'll add uh, six percent of aloe vera juice. I have a video on how I did aloe vera juice. You can check it out or I will link it in the description below. We'll also add our avocado cold pressed avocado oil. I also did a video on how to make cold pressed avocado oil so three percent of avocado oil so we are just making a small batch we are also adding hibiscus glycerite about four percent of that we don't want too much we don't want our hair to be sticky We are also adding extra virgin olive oil. In fact, there is no oil which um, beats uh, olive oil in terms of shine. So if you want shine hair, include olive oil. So about 3% of olive oil. 
Then we we'll also add in some essential also. I have peppermint and the tea tree essential oil. Um, I really love the feeling of these oils on the scalp. It rejuvenates your scalp. And especially if you have braids like it, it gives a refreshing to the scalp. So 1% of um, essential oils. Then we will shake our mist. So you have to make sure that every time you want to use it, you have to shake it because water and oil doesn't mix unless if you use an mouse fire. That is if uh, maybe you want to do something for self, but this is just a homemade. Yeah. And uh, you could add a preservative as well, but um, you can just put it in the fridge. Yeah, so our mist is ready. If you like this video, kindly subscribe, comment, so that you'll be notified when we do the next video. Thank you so much, guys, for watching, and God bless you. Bye-bye.